Hi everyone, and welcome to another episode of The Unsolved. In this video, we'll delve into the twisted and disturbing case of Miss Fanny Lillian Madison. This case is one of the most bizarre and unsettling in the history of American crime. But before we dive in, please hit that like and subscribe button and smash that notification bell so that you can get notified whenever we upload new videos. So let's dive back in. Fanny Lillian Madison was born on January 8, 1904, in a small town in Alabama. She was the youngest of four siblings, and her family lived in poverty. Fanny's parents died when she was only a child, and she was sent to live with her older sister. But life was not easy for Fanny. She suffered from a mental illness that made her paranoid and delusional. She became increasingly isolated, and her behavior became more erratic as time passed. On June 23, 1945, Fanny was walking near a church in Birmingham when she saw four children playing in the park across the street. Fanny, who was convinced that the children were possessed by demons, decided to take matters into her own hands. She approached the children and offered them candy. When they refused, Fanny became enraged and attacked them with a knife. Three of the children managed to escape, but six-year-old James Simpson Jr. was not so lucky. Fanny stabbed him to death. Fanny was quickly apprehended by police and charged with murder. Her trial was swift and decisive. Fanny's mental state was examined, and she was found to be suffering from schizophrenia. Despite this, the jury found her guilty of murder, and she was sentenced to death. Fanny's case became a cause célèbre, with many people questioning the fairness of her trial and the validity of the death penalty. Fanny's lawyers filed numerous appeals, but they were all denied. Meanwhile, Fanny's mental state continued to deteriorate, and she became increasingly agitated and unresponsive. On September 20, 1954, Fanny was executed by electrocution at Holman Prison in Alabama. Her death was met with widespread protests and outrage. Many people believed that Fanny was a victim of injustice and that her execution was a cruel and inhumane punishment for her mental illness. Fanny Lillian Madison's case remains controversial to this day. Her story has been retold in books, films, and television shows, and it continues to spark debate about mental illness, the death penalty, and the limits of justice. And that concludes our video on the twisted and disturbing case of Fanny Lillian Madison. If you found this video informative, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends.